is the Gramanan Ferry. It is a vital connection between Gramanan Island and mainland New Brunswick. Grand Manan is located approximately 30 kilometers south of the mainland in the Bay of Fundy. With the long distance required, deep waters, and the world's highest tides, it is not currently feasible to build a bridge connection between Grand Manan and the mainland. Ferries are therefore the only practical way to transport people, vehicles, and goods to and from the island. Grand Manan is the largest of the Fundy Islands and is home to over 2,000 residents. The island is known for its robust fishing industry, dramatic coastlines, beautiful beaches, and stunning wildlife. The Grand Manan Ferry is our link to the mainland from Grand Manan. Crossing is Black Harbor to Grand Manan is approximately an hour and a half, depending on weather, of course. But it's more reliable now. The ferries are bigger, so the weather doesn't slow us down as much. We start the morning, I come up and I do my checklist for making sure everything's working in the wheelhouse. Engineering, and they're starting up in the mornings and making sure the equipment's all working good. It's an ongoing process, we're always just checking things. We have a maintenance lists, greasing and things that the crews do. It's just an ongoing, doing a little bit all the time, just try to make sure the thing's always in good working order. And if you see something getting wrong, try to get it fixed before it becomes a real problem. Ferries are an important transportation link in New Brunswick. Much like highways and bridges in other areas, they connect communities together. Without ferries, many places would be difficult to access and communities as we know them today would not be possible. There are currently 13 ferries in operation in the province of New Brunswick. Grand Manan relies heavily on the ferry for tourism, shipping goods, business, and access to services not available on the island. There are currently two ferries in operation, the Grand Manan 5 and the Grand Manan Adventure. The Adventure has been in operation for um, nine years. Uh, the five, which is coming here now, she's 30 years old now. This one, I believe, was 82 cars supposed to be on the Adventure, depending on their size, of course. If you have a bunch of minis, you can get a lot on. But if they're all big half tons, it, about 82. Five, I believe, was a 63 car ferry. Uh, we're certified for uh, 360 people on the uh, Adventure when we have a full crew. At night, uh, on our fourth trip, we uh, downsize our crew and we're uh, certified for 200. Passengers can either drive or walk onto the ferry. They can then go to the passenger decks and enjoy the beautiful voyage. The ferry has many viewing areas where it's common to see whales, porpoises, seals, and seabirds. It is also equipped with lounges, cafeteria, gift shop, children's play area, nursing station, and other amenities to keep passengers entertained and comfortable during the crossing. The Grand Manan Ferry has over a hundred year history, with the first scheduled ferry service being in operation since 1884. Before that, earlier settlers traveled to and from the island with fishing and supply vessels. The ferry is very important for the economy of the island and just for the well-being of the island. The ferry itself is pretty much our lifeline. We do on the island have a grocery store, bank, and some basic necessities here, but for a business, more than likely all the businesses are getting a lot of their products from away um, just because of the bulk kind of necessity of what we need and how we need to get it kind of thing. So uh, we typically do a run once a week to St. John to go to kind of specialized places that only service kind of restaurants or hotels to get what we need. So we're always going back and forth on the ferry. That's how I go to school in the fall. That's how I go to the dentist. You have to work around to the boat. It's kind of your life revolves around the boat schedule and it's a way to socialize with people. 
Yeah, running the ferries is a rewarding job. Uh, you know you're helping the islanders. You are the link to the mainland. The Grand Manan Ferry not only connects Grand Manan Island to mainland New Brunswick, it also connects people, allows businesses to prosper, and tourists to seek refuge and reconnect with the natural world. <laughs>